family welcome back to my youtube channel in today's video we're making some crispy onion rings let's get to the video i'm going to start by cutting my onion as shown in the video and removing the outer cover After preparing my onion and washing it, I'm now going to make it, to cut it into rings, I'm sorry, at least a quarter inch thick, as shown in the video. While doing this guys, you have to be careful, you don't want to slice your hand too. So guys, I'm just going to take my time to cut to slice my onion I'm sorry I'm now just going to separate my onion into rings. Some will be imperfect, some will be perfect, some will be small, some will be large. But guys, that's, that's just the beauty of onion rings. You can just set the imperfect onion rings aside. You can still use them to cook. Onion rings are now ready. I'm just going to set them aside. Moving on, I'm now going to start preparing our butter. I'm going to mix together three quarter cup of all purpose wheat flour and a quarter cup of corn flour. I'm also going to add some two royco cubes for seasoning and some black pepper to taste. I'm also going to need some salt to taste too and then just going to mix all our dry ingredients together with a whisk as shown in the video I'm now going to add one cup of water at room temperature, bit by bit as I mix. I'm also going to add some 3 tablespoons of milk. You can also use club soda or whatever you have. If you don't have milk, you can just keep it. You can just use water. I'm just going to mix my butter well and make sure there are no lumps on it.
So guys, our butter is ready and as you can see, it's smoothly running. That's how your butter should be. I'm now going to dip my onion rings to our butter. So guys, you, you'll also need, I'm sorry, you'll also need some breadcrumbs for this recipe. I'm going to add some breadcrumbs to a separate tin as shown in the video. This is a little messy you guys, so I'm just going to use this tool that I have here, a tongue, to grab my onion ring and then I'm going to place it on the breadcrumbs and then I'm going to shake it and roll it on the breadcrumbs to make sure it's really really covered in well, the breadcrumbs, I'm sorry. So guys, you can also use your hand. Your hand is the best tool that you have. And just use your hand to roll your onion ring on the breadcrumbs. So guys, all I'm doing right now is making sure my onion ring is well, well covered with the breadcrumbs. That's what will bring the crispiness of the onion rings. When our onion ring is ready, I'm just going to set it aside on the plate. I'm then going to repeat the process with the other onion rings to show you clearly what I've been doing. I'm going to prepare all the remaining onion rings, then I'll be right back. So guys, I'm back and as you can see, I've prepared all my onion rings. Don't they look just so good? I'm now going to preheat my pan and then I'm going to add my oil. I'm then going to preheat my oil and, until it's hot. Are you? I used an already used oil, so <laughs> don't think my oil is not so clean. And then I'm going to add my onion rings as shown in the video. I'm then going to fry them both sides of the onion rings until they are golden brown as shown in the video. Just have patience you guys, this doesn't take so long. Just fry your onion rings well.
So guys, our first batch of our onion rings is now ready. I'm just going to remove them from the oil as shown in the video. I'm then going to put them on a silver plate. So guys, as you can see, our onion rings are really looking crispy, crispy. I'm now just going to repeat the process by frying all the other onion rings as shown in the video. All our onion rings are now ready. I'm just removing our last bite from the oil. Let me know what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'm still having a hard time deciding how to arrange my onion rings, but I'm just trying. I also did a great job you guys arranging them. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.